In this work, there's no vacation. I talked about it earlier this morning when I was moving out the tables day one of construction. And I'm just thinking how present you have to be in a high need school. You have to be 100% present. Because if, the, if there's that one time you're not present, then that's where our students fall through the cracks. I've been in a classroom that's been broken down. I operated in a broken down classroom for a long time where I was putting my own money, thousands of dollars a year, that I would invest because my kids needed it today. And I wasn't gonna wait because at the end of the day, my vision was to give them access. I taught at Hollenbach Middle School and teaching there for the last nine years, that's where I saw a lot of my students dream big, but when they got to high school, it was still a struggle for them to continue that dreaming. Some of our students, they're hopeless. They are. You know, they've been knocking, they've been, they've been screaming, they've been shouting. Nobody's listening. Some people probably wrote this place off like, ah, the oldest building, give it to them. I don't know what the story is, I don't wanna be like that, but you know, like, yeah. We are the rose that grew from concrete. We will, we will take your trash and make it into a treasure. We will, we will find, we will discover the beauty in this place and we will transform it. And then you are going to look at this place and say, wow, I don't even wanna put words in the mouth. I, I just know that we're gonna get some, some impressive sound effects out of these people because this place is not only gonna look impressive, but it's gonna feel impressive because of the kids who are walking in and out of these doors every day because they have dreams of college and dreams of transforming Boyle Heights.